Excuse me, Mr. Erlacher. Can we talk to you, sir? That's Casey Erlacher entering his home just hours after a federal indictment connected him to a multi-million dollar illegal betting ring. The brother of former Chicago Bear Brian Erlacher refused to answer questions as he entered his home. While in Orland Park, all is quiet at this house. No lights on inside, but when the feds raided it, court records shed light on what was inside. They say they found more than $1 million in cash, not to mention silver bars, jewelry, and gold coins totaling more than $441,000. This home belongs to the accused ringleader behind an illegal sports gaming business. The feds say Vincent Del Judas was able to afford this house because he would recruit gamblers and paid foreign sports books to make wagers on a website he started. The only problem, the entire operation and the millions it ranked in, completely illegal. The feds claim Del Judas hired several people to keep the bets and wagers pouring in. One of those hired, Casey Erlacher. Mr. Erlacher? CBS2 spotted Erlacher in the small town of Matawa. It's here where the indicted Erlacher serves as mayor of the village. He closed his garage door, avoiding any of our questions, but we'll have to speak to a federal judge soon. Now, the feds say this entire operation lasted from 2016 to 2019. Also caught up in this, a Chicago police officer. Um, he was also indicted today. Interim Police Superintendent Beck says that, that is very unfortunate, but also tells us that that officer has been stripped of his police duties. Reporting live tonight, Jermont Terry, CBS2 News. Jermont, thank you.